Welcome to our series, Ang Tatlong Pagbabago sa Buhay ng Isang Kristiyano. For the past two days, we've seen how God changes a person's spirit and soul. Will God also change our bodies? Let's find out. Goodbye, wrinkles! May wrinkles at white hair ka na ba? Normal lang yan sa nagkakaedad. But do you know what else to expect as you get older? Habang tumatanda tayo, tumitigas ang blood vessels at arteries natin, making us prone to heart diseases. Nagsishrink ang bones natin, kaya mag-ingat para iwas sa fracture. We also lose muscle mass. Madalas tayong constipated, laging naiihi, mas prone sa infection at decay ang ngipin natin. At marami pang iba. Ano ba yan? Napapasigaw ka na rin ba ng ayoko nang tumanda? Well, aging is part of life. Pero kahit hindi ka pa matanda, may mga bata rin namang nagkakasakit. That's why we should all take care of our bodies. However, the Bible gives us a comforting truth. Jesus Christ has been raised from the dead. And we who believe in Him will also be raised from the dead and be given a glorious body. When Jesus Christ comes back, instantly, babaguhin niya ang katawan nating nangihina at nabubulok. By His power, He will transform our bodies to be like His. Mind-boggling, di ba? Marirealize na lang natin kung ano talaga ang ibig sabihin nito kapag dumating na ang time na yun. In the meantime, let's imagine na posibleng kapag binago na ni Jesus ang katawan natin, mawawala na ang lahat ng wrinkles natin. Hindi na tayo magkukulay ng uban, magpapa-facial to hide our wrinkles, and take medicines and supplements to heal our diseases and to improve the quality of our life. If we are in Christ, we are assured that God will give us a glorious spiritual body in heaven. Until then, let's take care of our bodies na bigay niya sa atin on earth. Let us pray. Thank you, Jesus, that one day you are coming back for me. And when you take me, you will give me a new glorious body like yours to be with you forever. In Jesus' name, Amen. If you haven't been taking care of your body, make a list of the things you should be doing and start doing each one. Prioritize consulting a doctor kung may nararamdaman kang sakit. Believe God for healing and good health. Babaguhin tayong lahat. Ang ating katawang nabubulok ay mapapalitan ng hindi nabubulok. At ang katawang namamatay ay mapapalitan ng katawang hindi namamatay. Unang mga taga-Korinto, 1552, Thank you for joining us in our series, Ang Tatlong Pagbabago sa Buhay ng Isang Kristiyano. So remember, if you are in Christ, God changes your spirit instantly, changes your soul progressively, and will change your body in the blink of an eye. Praise God! If you've enjoyed listening to this message and would like to support the ongoing efforts of this ministry, you can do so by visiting cbnasia.org slash give or click the heart icon on the Tanglao app and make a donation. Ako po, si Eric Totanez. God bless you.